Good morning. I am Sunil. I am a GM MEP and Technology Division for Cash International, Doha, Qatar. Today, I am just going to briefly talk to you about contractual claims for MEP and civil contractors. I have been in the MEP industry for last four decades, having worked in various continents, various companies, and done a large number of projects including the iconic Burj Khalifa in Dubai in 2009-10, the US Air Base in Al Udaid in Doha, Qatar, World Trade Center in Abu Dhabi, and many other projects. I started in 1980 and uh, worked in India, Middle East, Canada, US, and back to Middle East now. My goal is to just give you a you know, a simple explanation to claims. Now, CAS International was formed in 2004 in the UK. And we have, we are specialists which cover the full lifespan of the projects in the bid to handover with multiple locations and a team of professionals to provide specialist service you know, to contractors. In Qatar, we have been successfully, we have successfully completed a lot of claim for various companies in MEP and other specialist contractors. Now, currently I can imagine most of the project directors and owners of companies are worried about, you know, the material price increase claims. Because of the volatility in the markets, the prices of basic materials have shot up maybe two times, three times. Now, we have helped numerous subcontractors and especially suppliers in various sectors to claim material price increase and recover the cost incurred as a result of exceptional and unforeseeable events of, of which has made fulfillment of contractual obligations excessively onerous in such a way that threaten the contractor with exorbitant loss. Our price increase analysis report demonstrates price increases encountered during procurement delivery. The report and claim submissions will provide entitlement and contempt for us records provided the cost has been increased as a result of unforeseen and exceptional events. Now, as a, as a contractor, you say, what are the benefits for me to file a claim? Because I don't want to spoil my relations. I would assure you that, you know, your relations with main contractors will not be affected. Why? Because you're asking for something genuine, which is supported by the law. And as you will see that a claim need not end up in litigation in court, but could be a way to have a better sympathetic, you know, treatment by the main contractor on various other issues affecting the project. So apart from the recovery of cost, you can mitigate your risk because once a claim is submitted, the main contractor will be wary to, you know, put penalties because a lot of reason for the delay could have been on the main contract. It also puts you to leverage other agreements with the main contract. Maybe he'll give a future project at a better rate, you know. And uh, resolving disputes through strong positioning, because if everything is on the record in the claim, all correspondences, all emails, all the approvals of various materials, then you are in a strong position to avoid litigation and come at a settlement. Thank you and uh, hope it helped.